I mean, it. Uh, I'm getting chills just thinking about it, man. Whenever he, uh, whenever he, and I know it was a dream come true for him, and that's. I think that's what what gets me the most excited about it. Um, you know, just seeing the way that he performed in high school and the, the things that he was able to do in high school. Um, it's like out of a video game. Um, you know, I, I I remember watching him. You know, during or after after the the Friday night games at Myrtle Beach. Uh, you know, we'd get home and turn the TV on and watch. You know, the regional highlights or whatever. And you know, he'd always be up there just running around. You know, throwing the ball down the field, doing what he did during the bowl game. Um, and obviously, he's had a he's had a tough road. You know, bouncing back and forth from positions. Um, but I, I really think it was just. Um, a combination of, of, you know, elite preparation and just being ready when, when your time is called um, and when your number's called. Um, and, and whenever his number was called, um, you know, he put on a show. Um, and just seeing the way that, that he prepared, you know, throughout the, the month of December and um, into the, the bowl preparation, those two weeks that we had uh, before it, man, it, it was just, it was so special to see. And, uh, you know, his, every time he'd walk into the meeting room, his eyes would light up because you know that's that's his that's his true love you know not only just you know playing the quarterback position you know wide receiver is he loves the game of football um and you see him out there now you know just you know getting after it running around um but he's also helping out you know some of the younger guys and um even some of the other receivers just you know kind of pulling them along um you know kind of giving them advice in different you know scenarios situations regardless of what what their position is um, you know, just kind of being that leader on, on the offensive side, being one of those guys that, you know, we know that we can count on and, you know, that we know that we can put him in, in any position and uh, he's going to help us succeed. So, I mean, he's, uh, he's an awesome dude. Uh, I mean, I, I met him. Um, I met him for the first time. I think I, I had DM'd him a couple of times. Uh, we had talked back and forth on Twitter, Instagram or whatever, but um, the, the day that he won, uh, Mr. Football, was, I think, was the first time I met him. Um, and I think I went to I went to another uh, camp with him or something. And, um, you know, since then, I've always, you know, taken a lot of pride and in, in just, you know, being his friend and being there for him um, because he's a selfless dude. Um, you know, he loves everybody. Um, and, and he'll tell you that, you know, every, every time I talk to him, um, you know, the whether it's on the phone or, or in person, man, he tells you tells you that he loves you. Um, and, and you know that he means every word. So he's one of those guys that kind of embodies all everything that Coach Beamer's about um, and, and certainly what the team is about. So um, can't wait to see what he's going to do this season.